Well, I hope you can all hear me because it's raining cats and dogs outside uh, and it's a little bit colder so you have to dress up but anyway we're gonna do a review on a new gin quite new gin on the market it's been available a couple of weeks or so months maybe two i don't really remember um but i order it from sustainable it's the mad lab spirits m32 and it's a handcrafted scandinavian uh, dry gin it's a quite new distillery as well i really love the artwork on the label um so i saw something here um Konstnärsällskapet Bro has done the artwork. But anyway, let's pop it up and see how it is. Mm. Ooh, lovely smell with a bit of some cinnamon, also some citrus, like more of a grapefruit note to it, and some like pepper, um, chili, pepper, pepperness, no, pep not pepper not like pe pepperness more like habanero maybe it smells really delicious quite exciting taste to it you get a little bit hint of some grapefruit or some citrus tones to it but you have this quite not overpowering taste to it but quite a lot of taste of uh, some more like paprika habanero but not spicy a little bit of pepperness a tiny hint of some maybe cinnamon great juniper flavor really delicious i think you've done an awesome work with this one m32 from mad lab spirits i'm just wondering what i can cook up for a cocktail on it but we will see that's for part two This is really awesome, and you get some just a slight hint of some rosemary as well, I think. But the, di the it's different kind of uh, peppers. It's different because it's it's not like habanero or something like that, but it has some notes to a little bit of paprika almost. But I don't think it, it it's in there. There's something that gives it that taste. But an awesome, awesome gin with some great pepperness, some zesty citrus grapefruit notes to it also a little bit sweet you got a nice rosemary just a tiny tiny hint on it of it yeah 
try it. We will see what I can come up with for a cocktail for part two. So check in tomorrow. Take care. Cheers.